first, like, whenever you had to have fun, you can actually dance and put a hands, it's just like everything. Right, it's a really heady show. So, how's it going in Atlanta? I mean, I know you're Broward kid, but how's Atlanta um, for you? I'm actually from Palm yeah. Beach, which is not quite Broward. It's, yeah. um, it's similar though, a little bit hotter. Okay. But, uh, <laughs> but nah, nah, Atlanta's dope, man. So it's cold right now. It's going to be a lot of I've been working with DJ Brown. I've got a home in uh, Andre for the good part of the order. I've been working with uh, after the kids out of Tallahassee. They, they made the trip. It's been dope, man. Atlanta's the music scene. It's so good. You so uh, still working with Ricky? Oh yeah, Rick, Rick, shout out to Ricky Fontaine, man. Like one of the dopest guitarists slash vocalists. Like, man, they're, they're well, so, uh, being from Gainesville, man, how has that influenced you? Um, yeah, I spent a lot of time in Gainesville. Gainesville is cool because it's like the best meeting. I met all kind of creatives, man, like just cool kids. The atmosphere is so open. All the shows are like free and stuff, you know what I mean? So it's like very uh, lively town, man. It was dope. dope. It's a nice little college town. But I was like getting back to Atlanta. They have like such a unique style of trap yeah. and everything going on over there with just like the wrist and all that stuff. Like, are you getting into that stuff? And I mean, it's cool. Like, I'm not one of those people that hates the trends. It's fun. Like, the music is fun. That's the only category that I can, you know, it's like there's no standard for those. So I'm all about the fun music. You know what I mean? Wrist is dope. Like, shout out to um, all those guys. Like, Thank you. Like, what Atlanta's really dope for is it has all the musicians. Like, yeah, the that's what I'm saying. Just like a crazy, you know, like yeah. make some music up there. Yeah. For sure, man. You can always make some. Come to Atlanta if you want to make your music. You know what I mean? They go back to your hometown and show them you got that shit. That's them. So, what are some of the events popping off in there that you've been able to participate in? Oh man, shout out to A3C. That's like my first, one of my first festivals in Atlanta. Um, amazing experience, like the hip hop culture coming together. As far as shows, like um, the food truck scene is popping on big Mexican food, man. So if you ever want to surprise me, bring those, you know, steak burritos with french fries on the inside. But, uh, <laughs> nah, Atlanta's dope, man. A3C, uh, the, the Unity Fest, that was dope too, man. Um, yeah, I mean, that show is going all the time, man. You can just go hit up a bar at Midtown or like little five points. It's always like, you know, yeah. uh, Moving forward, obviously actively making music still. What's, what's up next for you? Man, you know what's crazy? You, know, you remember how I used to be? I was dropping like shit all the time. Oh, yeah. As soon as I recorded in the studio, I'm trying to put it on SoundCloud. But now we, it's been like two years that I've been working on the same album. And um, it's, it's coming together, man. Like I really feel I'm finally at a point where my sound is truly unique. And it's, it's, it's dope, you know what I mean? I feel like, oh, if somebody heard us, they want to bite it. So we keep it under wraps, man. Keep building on it. You're holding out just yeah, a little bit. Just a little bit. Exactly. You okay. got to learn how to be patient. You know? What kind of adjustments have you made to your style? Like, Open it all the way up. Like, uh, <laughs> there's really not been any um, adjustments. It's just like taking away the limitations, you know, and then trying different things. If, if it sounds good, that is the key to keep going with it, you know. So I might be singing on a whole song and not even think about rapping, you know. So, it's not out of the ordinary for you. Yeah, you know, I've been, I've been an exploratory artist, I think, from the beginning. And now it's like the production is going as wide as the vocals. So, it's highly appreciated.